like I said in my video prior to this one, assuming they upload in the same order I'm sending them to upload, um, sorry the lighting sucks. I read these earlier today, wasn't going to film them, and then decided to go ahead and do so. But it's past bedtime, my husband has to be up early in the morning for work, and he's over there, so if you hear snoring, that is why. This is a book review of Thirsty Mermaids by Kat Lay. I think it's Lay. I'm not sure. Um, there's that. This is a chunky hardcover, so let's see if I can get some... Um, art where I can hold it up. Oh, and not flashy, guys. Uh, be aware there are boobs in this. And, and butts. There's a couple butts. Um, so yeah, there's an idea of what the art looks like. Uh, I didn't realize, but apparently Cat Lay has done a lot of lumberjanes. And it says that on the front of the book, co-author of New York Times best-selling series, Lumberjanes. I didn't see that. I just ordered this because it was on the Goodreads list. I'm trying to hit my goal this year. So, um, this is not tiny. Like I said, chunky, heavy hardcover. Didn't take long to read, though. I'm going to put it on my shoulder, even though it looks weird, because it's heavy and it hurts my wrist. Um, so this is about these three mermaids, um, who just they love to drink. They just love to drink. And one of them is a sea witch. And the way that they go about drinking is they find shipwrecks and easy, the sea witch friend, she creates an air bubble so that the alcohol doesn't dissipate and then they can drink it. Well, they run out. So they decide it's a great idea to, Easy does a spell, and they get turned into humans, and they go on land, and drink. Like, there's more to it than that, and how they have money, like, it's explained and everything. And then they realize they don't know how to go back to being mermaids. So they made friends with the bartender at the bar they went to, which is called the Thirsty Mermaid, and... And she's helping them out and teaching them about, like, capitalism and money and, hey, y'all need to get jobs and you have to wear clothes and uh, you need more than one outfit and you have to wash it. And, you know, just all these human things. And um, Easy is dealing with some body dysmorphia because, like, the other two, Tooth and, I forgot the third one's name, um... Pearl and Tooth, um, they're just like, eh, it'll sort of eventually, we'll deal with the human thing for now, but Easy is dealing with some serious body dysmorphia because, like, she's not human, but she's stuck in a human body, and, like, she's not, like, being warm-blooded just is not right to her. She can feel her blood having human lungs just does not feel right and it's like this whole thing um so she's dealing with that and it's just it's quite a good book i gave it four stars um if you don't mind boobs and butts and like there's not a lot of it it just clothes aren't really a necessary thing for mermaids they're kind of optional um and that's more in the very beginning of it anyway. It's just, it's a really good story. I ended up really enjoying it. And if it sounds at all interesting to you, I would definitely recommend it. Um, I don't think I spoiled anything. So, yay, progress. Um, ow. But have you guys read that? Do you want to? Questions, comments, opinions, let me know down below. Otherwise, don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.